coverage you can count on continues with Heather Heron. He survived two plane crashes before he graduated from high school. Former Canterbury star Austin Hatch is now playing basketball at the University of Michigan. And this afternoon, the U.S. Basketball Writers Association honored him in Indianapolis. News Channel 15 Sports Director Glenn Marini joins us live in Indy with more on Hatch's achievement. Glenn? Well, Heather, I don't know if you know, but uh, somebody a lot more intelligent than I am crunched all the numbers, and it turns out uh, for one person to survive two separate plane crashes where there was at least one fatality in each of those crashes, the odds are one in 11 quadrillion. We're talking an 11 with 15 zeros on the back end. So to say Austin Hatch is maybe a one in a million type story, you're selling him quite a few zeros short. Now, he was honored by the U.S. Basketball Writers Association this afternoon, not for surviving those two plane crashes, but for what he's been able to do afterwards. Austin just completed his freshman season of basketball at the University of Michigan, played in five games for the Wolverines. In fact, scored his first point on a free throw against Coppin State December 22nd. But he said it's what's happening away from basketball, the way his story has been able to ba uh, impact basketball fans and non-basketball fans alike that he has enjoyed the most. Absolutely, Glenn. It, um, you know, feel, feel, feel very good, humbling for sure. It's um, you know, a great honor, but as I said in, my, in the speech that I delivered after receiving the award, I haven't gone, gone, woke up in the morning throughout my road to recovery with the goal of, of being recognized or inspiring, inspiring people across the country. I mean, obviously, it's great that both have happened, um, particularly primarily inspiring people. I'm glad that, you know, as a result of all that I've been through, I've been able to, you know, to use it to make a positive impact on others. But that hasn't been my goal. And I'm, I'm just, I'm humbled and honored that it's happened. That's why I, I said, people have said, write a book. And I'm saying, you know, well, quite, quite frankly, I don't, I don't really know what, what the, next, the next few chapters or the next chapter is going to be. So say, hypothetically, say, say the book is 10 chapters long. I'm probably about two or three chapters in right now. So, I mean, you know, I have se seven or eight more chapters to go before it's done. And, you know, we'll just see where the road leads. And coming up tonight at 6, we're going to hear more from Austin Hatch. We'll also